Light, Queen of, an excerpt from the Masters in their retreats. Light, Queen of, Profiles of the Ascended Masters. The Queen of Light focuses the action of the Crystal Fire Mist and the Crystal Sword. Wherever she goes, she directs her light rays through the Crystal Flame and radiates the full complement of the Christ Consciousness through the Crystal Prism. Her legions of light wield the crystal sword and may be called upon to cut through the densest human creation, to clear the four lower bodies of all that is not reflective of the crystal clear radiance of the Christ mind. Her consciousness is at the point between the crystal and the mist where matter becomes spirit and spirit becomes matter. This is truly the razor edge of the Christ realization. When the Queen of Light and her legions wield their crystal swords on behalf of the freedom of mankind, there is a tremendous release of crystal lightning. The Queen of Light speaks as a mother and is most concerned for the children of the world. She enlists our aid on their behalf and says, Some of you have pledged at inner levels to take your stand for those sweet children from the moment that they are conceived to the age of seven. That is the tender forming period. Those of you who have taken your vows must remember that the flame of application must be used daily. And these children require your assistance each morning when you pray. I would like to develop in you the sense that the children of the world, the babies, are so much a part of your own self that not to call for them would be much like not calling for your own tube of light or not feeding yourself or not taking care of your immediate family. They must be under your wing, for your wing is the wing of the Almighty, and that is the unfailing light of God, the protection that is required. They are bombarded from every side, and so now they must be bombarded with light, with the power of the fiat of the light and the spoken word. O Mother of the world, I call to you this night. I, the Queen of Light, implore you, awaken to your mission to guard the Holy Christ Child. Oh, we long for the day when there are prepared upon earth those souls who can truly receive the avatars and the incoming seventh root race. And even as we are preparing that great continent of South America, so the hordes of shadow are moving and also to claim these children even before they are born. O oh, beloved ones, turn now and face South America, realizing that that continent must be protected. You must provide the pathway of light over which the Golden Age children might come. The Goddess of Light, the Queen of Light, and the Goddess of Purity from the Trinity of the Three Cosmic Beings, who has majored on the one-pointed goal of focusing the intense light of the Christ Consciousness of God. The retreat of the Queen of Light is in the etheric plane over the island of Sicily near Messina.